Well, here we go, everybody. It's uh, time to wrap up phase one of Hardcore Heritage. We're in Lower Guck right now, one of the big all-time favorites. Favorite dungeons of all time. And it's uh, even better to do it at har Hardcore Heritage. Um, so here we go. We've got, uh, with us, we got Pius, played by Zizzy. He's going to be a monk. Look at that nice weapon. We got Calamity, played by Shadow, and he'll be our tank. And our rogue is Habilthorn. I'm your host, Turkish Angora. And I am your enchanter. Uh, we have a frog lock here. You can see he's blue to us, but that doesn't mean a lot unless you know what our level is. And our level is 78. It truly is hardcore heritage right here. Here's my character. It's basically uh, just defiant geared. So no TBM geared, so it's not too buffed yet. So we're at 25,000 hit points. We've got to be careful not to slip on a banana peel because bad things can happen. That's right, so you can take a look at what you would have with the uh, Defiant Gear. So this is going to be a little bit harder, but hey, we do have one thing. We have Charm, a Cajole, and I can Charm up to 77. So as we go down there, I'll find one Hapless Frog and make him a victim. Later on, we will be joined by Iceman, and he'll bring character, and we'll get the party started. It's about time to start because you can hear my upstairs neighbor, the kids wrestling furiously. They're probably excited because I'm doing a live stream, but yeah, that's right getting their thing on so let's go ahead and let's see what we're gonna do here we're gonna load a different spell we're gonna load a rune and we can go like this but before we get started I have a special announcement to make I want to go out and thank our sponsors I want to thank JTGHM for his generous donation Sean Boyd and Mike Massas of course everybody else that has donated want to thank them too you all have made this a wonderful experience and you're making it a great channel thank you so much and more stuff will be coming on the way we'll see how many people are viewing out there if people are viewing i'll start releasing more stuff over memorial day weekend otherwise we'll wait till everybody comes back so people don't miss out on a lot of stuff there's some good stuff coming up froglock shin lord um yeah, a few other things like that they're going to be good uh, a lot of people have been enjoying this stuff if you haven't seen it if you want to see some crazy trains in Runny Eye, check out the making of Battle Lord or making of the Black Alloy Medallion. It's another good one. Okay, thanks. And also, guys, if you'd like to support the channel, make sure you hit the join button or you can hit the dollar sign in Super Chat uh, and it'll, you can send a donation. I appreciate all the donations you all have been given and it's been making this a great experience. Okay, so uh, switch around, switcheroo. I hope we'll be able to get the Iceman in here, I think we should be able to. Uh, 78, let's check out everybody else's level. Calamity, 79. Pius, 78. Havothorn, 77, probably. So let's see, where are we going today? Today the plan is to do the dead side. And the reason why we could plan to do the dead side is because nobody cares about the live side. Now the evil eye is up. It'd be cool if he had another bag, but this level, you probably don't worry about bags too much. But you do worry about the supplier and you're worried about the cavalier and stuff like that and we can work this whole area here get see what's gonna fall out here so the way this goes if you haven't seen it, I have a video on how to navigate lower guck first destination is gonna be the bedroom we are in here and right there we're gonna head down we're gonna go into the bedroom from the bedroom we're gonna head over to the supplier camp and maybe I'll get one of those gargoyles. I've always loved having gargoyle pets. But the bad thing about having gargoyle pets is like you have to, well, what the heck. Let's get a gargoyle pet. Okay, so first things first, we're going to head down here. Stay with me, guys. We're going to get up to the undead area. And when we get up to undead area, we'll switch over our inviso. Now, don't go past this area. Go to about right here. When we get here, oh, oh, we got a ghoulie. Oh, you know it, and this is going to be... Yep, I knew it. Okay, you... Ay, ay, ay. Okay, you're going to be my pet. Hold on. No, hold on. Let me let me get him as a pet. The, the, guys? Okay. There's me... another one right behind him. Yeah. You, you, let me get this guy that has Tosh on. Okay, he's my pet. Okay. Let's get this other guy over there. There you go, yeah. And, and the undead guys, you don't have to worry about them running or anything. Okay. Ah, got another one. Stay close, don't go around the corner. Because Choo Choo Train will be developing. Got a Mez. And we got one Merc with us. Actually, two, I should say. 
And we got another one. Oh, wow. Oh, this is the guy we're killing. Okay, get my nuke skill up. And bang and tongue. We don't want the tongue. All right, go ahead and uh, kill this next guy here. So nice when you have your healer merc. He just takes care of you. Go get my pet and gear. Get on it. See if we have any weapons we can give him. Check a pile here. We have J boots. No weapon. I'll get one later. Okay, I like these undeads. They don't run at all. Now we do have the option. Oh, that is a fine seal two hander. Sorry, don't need it. Okay, so we uh, you don't want to hit Inviso here at this point, and the reason why we don't, well, we could. How about this, guys? We kill this guy, go group Inviso undead, get into the bedroom, set up there, and pick up a pet there, because this guy, I believe, is only 75. Why don't we do that, guys? Break him, we'll kill him. Okay, Calamity, you go ahead and pop uh, group Inviso undead. That's it. Nice job. Go ahead, take him down. Got slow on him. Hey, how'd you get over there? Oh yeah, it's that fly swatter. The fly swatter. Uh oh, the fly swatter. Okay, be careful with the fly swatter. I went to hand to hand. Okay, that's it. Yeah, use those fists. Okay, and he dropped. Uh, I'm going to take the fine seal, so I give it to the next pet. And there is some elegant defined plate bracers. Uh, who uses plate here? Amity? I do, but I'm not interested in it. Okay, I'll just throw it your way anyway. Okay, perfected group Inviso Undead needed. Gotta love there that. There you go. Oh, that is so nice. I gotta wait to 95 before I get that. Okay, guys, get ready to do some underwater swimming. Get ready. Here we go. Oh, got three in here surfacing in the bedroom. This is 75. Let me get check out our pet. 75. Looks like the the choice is going to be all 75s okay let me go over here i'm going to get i don't know if i should get one of these guys yet how about this maybe we try to get all the way past these guys all right let's slow lynch welcome aboard okay so now the trick in here we got to be careful if we go through this way because you have to um uh, let me go like this the trick is is you have to stay close to the left as you see there's bats in here and there's this ghoulie guy, see the vampire bats? So he can't see us, but they can see us, the vampire bats. So stay hard left. Okay, everybody got me? Stay hard left. Like that. Oh, shoot. Somebody. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. 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 Wrong way. Oh, gosh. I mean, let me see if I can vein death him. No, 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 no. Let's try to charm him. I'm going to try to just fight through it. We can do it. I'm going to charm this guy. Okay, got him. Let me go with a stun. Oh, I should load for crowd control. Going to mez one. Going to start mezzing. Did you, did you take the knight as a pet or are we killing him? No, I got a pet right here. He's a Shin Ghoul knight. I just did that to break down uh, stuff. There's one that he's fighting. He's fighting Vizghul Knight. I guess he's coming with us. Pop them with a stun. Okay, let's go for Vampire Bat.
What the heck? Whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. How did we get all that? That's a great question. Is your is your ranger getting beat on? No, not at all. Ranger's not in a group. Oh my gosh. Well, like I said, get you two get ready to feign death. Oh shoot. What the heck? Well, let's see if me feigning drops any aggro. Oh, let me get this guy back. What the heck? The whole dungeon's coming alive. All right. Um, whoa. I mean, do the bats run? It's possible one of them got away. The, who is the thing fighting against? Kill this vampire bat real quick. Let's just kill him. Um, we're going to have to do a corpse recovery with that. There's a mega train coming. Kill him real quick. We try to camp out right here. And you guys can feign. I don't see who they're aggro, though. They're down on my list, but... Uh, they're there, but they're not showing any aggro percentages. There they come. Holy smoke. Okay, guys, feign it. Yeah, it's nuts for Jeep. There's no way. Okay, going to go with a stun. Let's try to do this. Oh, gosh. Feign death, guys. Feign death. I don't have AE stun. Oh, my gosh. Holy, we're going down. I suspended my Merc, that way we can bring him up for reses. Okay, great. Oh my gosh. One of those stupid bats got away. Ayla Troy, welcome up. Welcome back. I remember you from way back. Good to have you back. That's right, yeah. I didn't realize it would be that big. This stuff is from downstairs. The bat went all the way down to the bottom. Oh my. Mega train. Yeah, yes. but I didn't see okay, one get away. So snare all bats. Yes. Uh, see, this is the only time we're running into live stuff. Once we get past Gargoyle Land, we'll be okay. I'm going to go with the undead pet from, you know, when we get down there, so it'll, n it'll never run. Going to the all go away. This hallway we're in should be safe right here once these guys all leave. That's right. Uh, Ella, Ella, um, uh, Ella Troy, we should have, uh, I should have camped it. I was just thinking like we get, uh, gosh, you're right. Should have camped it. Yeah, that's right. Should have camped it. You guys are so right. How's it looking there, Zizzy? Uh, there's one guy waiting to take off, okay, but uh, nice I got like three minutes before I can bring the Merc back up anyway, so I'm not moving. For it right okay, great. Yeah. The only thing we got to be careful of is the bats will come up. But I think it's going to be later rather than earlier. Going to AFK your moment, guys. Okay, we got Gore Dirt incoming. Gore Dirt, uh, we'll suspend one Merc when you get here. And then I'll suspend right. mine. And well, wait, wait until we have a Merc do some mezzing or res. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get our reses first. We're down by, you know, where the first, the bed, passive bedroom. Yep. And like they say, every expedition starts off with a good wipe. So get that wipe out of our system. I heard all the gory details. That was the biggest train ever. I, oh, these crazy bats. You know what I should have done? It's just pacified the darn thing and then just done and that. instantly, too. Yeah, I should have just pacified him. I, sometimes you get so casual about it because, oh, it's lower guck and all that. I've been here a million times, but then, well, big trains made for trains. Oh, good. Calamity's up. At least we, uh, Calamity and uh, Pius survived. Yeah, we both have Merc healers. Okay, great. Two minutes. Good job in putting your uh, Merc on passive. Now, if we had the AE team, that would have been like Christmas right there. Because we would have just blasted them all. But at this level, they wouldn't have died. 
How about you, Calamity? How's your Merc doing? I my Merc was not active. I had suspended it for the so we could get everybody in the group. So I can bring mine up any Oh yeah, bring yours up then. Just so we can get uh the res is going. Okay, it's resin someone. Okay, great. Otherwise, they'll send me back to good old POK. Yeah, we will have to use a slower clarity, but I'll take it. Yeah, I pulled Havelthorn a little bit further into the hall. Good move. Oh, it's nice to be back. Okay, now I'm a big elf. All right, let me get the regen up. Gonna have to be real careful this time with my flimsy buffs. Got some experience, I think. There, now you're a little elf. Okay, great. Okay, so uh, let's go with, uh, actually, hmm, I think we should go with, uh, who should have the, Pius has got the Merc, so. Um, well, is yours a J5, Pius? Yeah, my, yeah mine's a J5. Okay, so if we can suspend, um, there we go, let me invite uh, Gordur. All right. Oh, the, your party is full. Well, what happened? I'm the only one in it. No, if yeah. we have one merc, it's still up. It looks like. Well, Pius brought his merc up. Oh, okay. I thought that was the one we wanted. Yeah, that's the one we want. We have to wait. Till wow, now. looks like he got his merc out with like what, fifteen percent of life left. That's smart. Now we have Gifid. That's uh, Calamity's merc, I think. Oh wait, that's mine. Excuse me. Yep, mine okay, is suspended let me again. Suspend mine. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, send him an invite. Okay, Gordert, welcome aboard. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Looks like he. Oh, he's gonna need some buffs. He's got Hasting and Milex. Oh boy. I don't think I'll be able to match that. And at least you have the buff. So when your buff wears out, I'll put whatever on you. Let me get my um, hit point buffs. That'll work. Okay, so tonight our goal is going to be dead side. Uh, we're going to do that. Um, there's nothing really up on the live side except the Minotaur Patriarch and the Elder, and that's it. I don't know if they have anything good. I should probably try to rig for more crowd control here. Uh, just because of what happened there, I don't know if we'll be able to ever stop that again. If we get a big giant train like that, well, let me change it here. Uh, let's see, let me see what's done I've got. only goes up to 78 that's not gonna help yeah the problem with the Mez with Enchanter at this level is they don't go very high as you can see here this one only goes to 83 so we're gonna need that but the other one doesn't go high enough and welcome aboard Brendan Wallach good to hear from you again so let's see what else we have color cataclysm yeah 78 yeah see these these messes are kind of kind of weak here we can't do anything to really uh, mess them nothing at all that's the thing they've really gimped the enchanter in early levels you can go with all these stuns and everything and hit everything but later on you, you it's all like this one you need somebody hits above 80 but everything can only see these can mess above 83 but other mess ae mess can only mess below 77 which is kind of useless. 
So what we'll do, and not much we can do. Just put a slow up, that's it. We're gonna charm and uh, that's all we can do. All right, let's see here, how's my buffs looking? Oh wow, I lost 10,000 hit points there, that's scary. All right, J5, we're counting on you, and Gordurt too. Okay, let me set uh, Gordurt up as a main assist. I guess we should do that. And I'll set him up as a main tank. Well, actually, just main assist. Pius will be set as a main the puller. All right, guys. So um, where are we again? Okay, so from here, we want to stay to the we right. We want to stay to the right. Sir. Yep. As soon as you go to the right here, off to your left, you're going to see five of them in one little area. Okay, pop us with a uh, group. Uh, oh, you got it already. Group perfected, invisible, and dead. Head into the right. Um, to the so right, and then right on your left. I think I'm still visible. You, you do have invisible and dead on you. Oh yeah, I just don't see the parentheses. My bad. Yeah, it won't have invisible. Okay, so these are seventy-five still. Now there's gargoyles. Gargoyles are seventy-five, so it looks like it's a lot of seventy-fives. The tall ghoulie over there. Let's go forward here. I'll find a victim. I think this guy, he's a wizard. He's kind of a, a junkie. He's not good. He's 76, but we're going to have to kill him because uh, we're heading for the supplier first. And I'll pick up one of the suppliers. So let's go ahead and fix this guy's wagon. Oh, wait. I loaded Dispel. Yeah, let's get that Dispel. Got an ad. Okay, I'm going to pick up this ad. He's going to be a pet. Charming him. Okay, he's mine. Okay, let me put him in here. Uh, my pet. Okay, and next we should have the supplier up. If you need me to pacify anything, otherwise we just pull them all. We do a pull and miss. We get a rune up. That might save us two seconds. Let me know when you're ready. Okay, one second. Okay. Uh, got the map. All right, we're ready. All right, incoming. Oh, uh, there wow. was Two. the assassin was hidden. Okay, let me go ahead and mez uh, Wangul Knight up there. Okay, let's go ahead and send uh, my guy in the supplier. Uh, I'm gonna try to mez assassin. Let's see if he's mez. 83 should be got assassin on mez. Oh, supplier's going down. Putting the slow on him. Okay, preparing the next victim. I'm on slow. Oh, thanks, Igorg. Okay, drop some belts. That's good. Okay, we can take Assassin next. There you go. Nice job. Sword, I couldn't see him. Yeah, he's an Inviso guy. Like the Froglock Warden. And if you guys are interested in Inviso mobs and Upper Guck, Froglock Warden will be coming up soon for all you guys to see. He's another sneaky one that's Inviso all the time. Okay, going slow on him. Nice work. Okay, there it is. Mask of Deception. There's two of them. Dark and Mask of Deception. I know Alathorn would be very interested in that. Congrats. Be real careful with my flimsy hit points. And this has got, got thick banded belt too. Very nice. Okay, we'll take a sit down and check out our awesome loot. Fine steel great staff going into dumps. 
dark and mask Ooh, look oh wow check this out there you go what you always wanted and um, dark and thick banded belt here they are everybody so look at this pretty good look at one unlocks passive aas and the other one look at it gives you illusion dark elf uh of course you i don't know if you can click it from your inventory but you bard or rogue and uh we do have a rogue here we have gore dirt and uh uh Habblethorn. you guys ready to roll for it i'll pass that to Habblethorn. i have the low level version of it okay it's going to you Habblethorn. i've got the low level version too i just kind of want it for nostalgia yeah get this one this is once a year it's going to you Habblethorn, and here's a low level one also now thick banded belt it's up for roll guys uh i'm gonna set to auto ask roll all right i'm just rolling on it for the clip over there um pass it Been a bill to work. oh yeah you lost your bet. yeah i get him here there we go all right okay so they're all up to, for roll guys um thick band belt wow the dark and thick band belt looks so much better than the regular one look at that eternal ward unlocks passive aa so increase your resistance to magic cold and disease that already is worth it oh yeah i'm gonna pass on this one since i got the mask okay you can always roll for the low level one too I mean, you probably don't want it, but just in case. Might be worth some tribute. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, guys. Uh, let's get this rune back up. There's the only thing saving me from hits by my vicious pet. Say, we never do use that, do we? Guild tribute. No, I just dumped my garbage in there, and then it got up so high. Ooh, wow, my mana's not so hot here. I'm used to oh, 94 region. That's that shouldn't be anything to complain about. In the TLP server, you're lucky if you have 40. Oh, there's an AUG in there too. Really? Oh shoot. I missed it. Oh, that is right. Oh, that's yeah, that's a tradable AUG. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice one. Yeah, I think I have one of those in my shared bank, so I can't take it. Yeah, I think I have that too. All right, guys, let's uh, head down. The next one we want to look for Cavalier, I think. That's the next one. Then after that, we'll go, after we do the Cavalier, we'll um, head around and we'll, we'll be down there. We can look Cavalier, Savant, check Executioner. And then after that, we'll head up to uh, Frenzy. There should be a Frenzy and then Archmagus all the way to the Ghoul Lord. I don't think the Ghoul Lord is up, but we can always clear him off and then check him. Oh, wow, these pets are really, really bad, bad, bad pets. Wow. Oh he hits goodness. you pretty hard. He really does. Yeah, that was my fault. I, by reflexive action, because we're going to move, I hit Invis to Undead. Yeah. Oh, you scared me. <laughs> That's funny. I was like, why? Well, okay. someone had to. We don't have a bard with us. That's right. Okay, Gore Dirt, which way to the Cavalier? Oh, it's this way here. We fighting down? I guess we have yeah, to. Yeah, we're going to have to fight these yes. guys here. Okay. All right, here we go. Mezzing one. Missing two. Got them both. Oh, shoot. How did... Well, wait, wait, wait. How did this happen? Holy smoke. Oh, my gosh. You know, you, you know you're going to get... Where are they all up. come from? Yeah. They must be within aggro range. Let me start messing them real fast. Doing what I can do. Let me 
get that wizard guy popping him. Okay, guys, I got three locked down. Gonna lock down number four. You keep good. I got four locked down. Okay, take what you can. Okay, let's go on him. Okay. This guy, I'm gonna dispel him. Yeah, you can see the difference. The pace is, oh wow, what a difference. The TLP server is like, the pace is really slow. Okay, your choice, guys. Relocking this guy here. Got some crazy aggro down here. And he brought up a pet, how dare he. Alright. My ghoulie boy here. All yours. Working the slow. So nice to have these mercs going. You just you get the mercs up and then you just relax. Don't forget to right. pet and game. <laughs> right to the point where they die. Yeah, I like how they don't run down here. That's what. I need to load Theft of Thought so I can leech mana from them. And that horn sound is not, uh, that's somebody outside honking. It's not the ghouls down here. One moment, guys, I gotta get a mana leech loaded up real quick. Uh, let me load here. Be two more in the next room. Okay, still so on second. Okay, if you need pacify, I can do that. Okay, Ghoul Knight in the back. I'm going to go ahead and pacify him. Okay, he's on pacify. Yep, I'm rigged just for crowd control. Okay, I'm just going to leave this stuff on the ground. Oof, wow, hear that smacking sound. Getting good experience. Okay. Cool Cavalier, I hear him. Let's see him moving down the stairs. Ooh. Be a couple down here. Okay, there we got this guy right here. Should we pick him up? Can you pacify through walls? Sure can. Let me uh, target your target. Pacify my target. Okay, pacify incoming. Okay, got one. Okay, that's good. We got this guy here. Good. 
1% per kill. F3 in the Cavalier room. Okay, uh, target your tar I'll target your target when you need pacify. Now? Okay, stand by. Here we go. Casting. Oh! Whoops. <laughs> Sorry about that stupid pet. Pet decided to break. Uh oh, we got a choo choo train here. Oh gosh, that's not good. Whoa, this stuff hits really hard here. Uh, trying to mez one. Oh gosh, this is what I mean, guys. It hits so hard. Okay, let me get this guy in the support dirt on. Thank you so much. Wow. You see how fast they kill you. Okay, got him on. Let's get to this guy here. My pet just broke at that moment. Okay, let's start that all over again, picking Gordert's target. Okay. Okay, here goes Pacify 1. Uh, Pacify 2. Okay, Pacify this one, please. Here it comes. Okay, should have them all. Cavalier Pet. Coming, Cavalier. Nice. Oh, he's got a Ghoul Knight coming to uh, Mez and the Ghoul Knight. Holy smoke, this stuff. I'm going to mess a knight. Knight's been mess on Cavalier. Wow, look at how hard these guys hit. This is they're not joking. Okay, got him slowed. Nice pull. Wow, we really do need to be creative. You guys out there are getting to see just how fast the game plays at this level. Oh, nice. Okay, this is our boy here. And uh, Darken Epl Adamantite Eplets, uh, Athali Gloves, Fine Seal Dagger. Don't want to give that to my pet. I just tear my face off. Look at the Eplets, those are pretty nice. Uh, if anybody like them, Warrior, Claire, Calvin, Shadow Knight. Okay, guys, anybody want it? I'll roll so they don't rot. Okay, let me try to get this guy in this. Okay, got him. Oh, just hammering me. Okay, gonna set it to auto ass roll. Wow. Gonna have to sit for a moment. Blowing through mana. Grab a drink real quick. Okay, go for it. Eighty nine percent in. Wow, these guys just hit so hard. Yeah, so you can see just how fast the game is. If I don't get him within two mezes, he'll probably kill me. Otherwise you have to have really good gear at fifteen thousand hit points. This is basically defined geared, but with higher level buffs and all that. You get up to 25,000, but that makes a difference. Without that, it's a struggle. I'm going to go scout ahead while you've met up. Okay, great. Thanks. Executioner is not up. Yeah, we'll have to clear off his spot. What we could do is we could clear. I got an option for you guys. We could clear off the placeholders or the rooms, then go up to the Ghoul Lord, come all the way back down, and by that time, Ghoul Lord should be pop. Or we could just go and uh, there. I don't see any more names that are up uh, on the dead side. The other dead live side that are up are Patriarch and Elder, the Minotaurs, and that's it. And Tactician, of course, way down there.
So whatever you guys think would be better. I follow my leader. <laughs> That's good. Well, um, you know, uh, either way. The other way to do it is to go up to the ghoul lord and then um I actually I think um, let me look at the map here. Got safe fall. Uh I'll tell you what, I think we should head up towards the frenzy. The hand the hand should be up. That's so weird he's not on track. Archmagus and the ghoul lord and then swing back down and maybe we'll see them pop up on track by the time we're done at least try the frenzy and then we can try the elder and the patriarch if you guys want i'm down for anything okay let's head up this way here okay we got these guys here we're gonna have to we pacify this guy over here oh just when my pet says no you're not pacifying anybody Oh my gosh. Wow. Half dead. We got some action here. Oh my. Hey, mez this other guy over here. Mezzing one. Got a mez. Get that other. I'm going to mez the other guy. My pet is still mezzed. He's going to be mezzed for a while. Nice. Man, I am really digging those poison crits for 10k. Wow, you're doing 10k crits? When I proc on my poison, yeah. Man, that's nice. Got one guys, one back here, guys. Okay, there you go. My pet woke up. Nice work, everybody. Okay, to the audience out there, you can see with Charisma 443, doesn't matter a whole lot. Uh, it's based on Magic Resist for the charm that is. I'm going to go ahead and pop Rune on us. If this is the only protection you have, it's popping that Rune. How bizarre. My Charisma is higher than yours. Really? Yeah, 471. Ooh, wow, I love those. Okay, pacified that guy in the hallway. All right, guys, he's up. Whoa, forgot about these, my bad. Oh, okay, let me go ahead and mess him. Dude, yeah, I forgot all about the guy behind there. All right. Sweet. Good job. Let's see. 
Oh, wow, getting up there. And this is known as a safe haul, everybody. Oh, there's one guy. Should we pull this ghoul knight here? Oh, yeah. Oh, and he's carrying fine steel even better. Mezzing the ad. Comes in night. Okay, going to Wow, got him on Mez. Interesting aggro here. You can see it's kind of a lot of aggro. One thing about it is the trains are just like they were in the old days. Exactly the same. pet break yeah it looks like that just happened here nice job Benzingham. yeah the pets break all the time uh, you know like when you get to 110 and ring a scale we had pets that just last one tick and then they break uh, some of them are, you know they'll, they're that bad So charming and all that, that's for the early days when it's a lot of, it's fun time. Okay, I guess we'll head over to clear off the frenzy spot. And if you're just joining us, we're doing Hardcore Heritage, Lower Guck, the big daddy of them all. Really, really hard at level 78. Uh, where'd my pet go? Come on, pet, get on him. That is weird. My pet took a hike somewhere. Regroup. Attack. Finally, he's, he is out there having a burger. Okay, this is a tricky spot. We gotta go left. Oh. Need it. Pass fire, we just pull them. Messing the other one. Oops, this guy broke out. Okay. Guess they're fighting both. Alright, yeah, we can take them both. Oh, it's just, I can't hear you through your mic. Yep, just a little hissing. Somebody lost their mic. And, uh, can you hear me now? Yeah, now we can hear you. Okay, sorry about that. And uh, David Hedinger, um, we just started a little while ago. Uh, if you saw it live, it might have been the notification thing. Sometimes YouTube messes up uh, with how they do it. Okay, there'll be one in the hallway to the left. Make a left. 
I got two. Oh, what where'd those guys come from? Wow. Mezzin. Oh, that one's taken. Got it done. And they do have magic resist. Got a got a add. I'm gonna as an add. Got him. Yeah, David Hedinger. What happens is sometimes when I set the stream up you know schedule it uh youtube sets it one stream up to say that it started at a certain time but it really didn't start at that time it's kind of weird so sometimes i find it better not to even list it as upcoming then it you know it's going to start when it really starts Okay, wow, that's awesome experience, 97% in. And we don't have the uh, Frenzy yet, but we have a Bloodthirsty. We have a Dar in the middle. He's level 78. We still have a Knight on the aggro list? Oh, that's we my pet. Ones? Yeah, he's my petster. So what I'll do is I'll mez the Knight in the middle. I mean, pacify the Knight in the middle, and then pacify... Like bloodthirsty, and we pulled a wizard or something. Pacifying okay. another one. Got him, and then going with uh, bloodthirsty. Standby, pacify. Oh, can't do him. We're gonna have to do the wizard. So pacifying wizard on left. Then we're gonna pull the bloodthirsty on the right. All right. He is eighty-two. Wow, no wonder. Come on in. Good. He's stunnable, slowable. Mana drainable. Wow, I mean, this mana drain hardly does enough. That's it, tearing him up. And he dropped the torn page, which we don't need. They're going to drop it on the corpse. Okay, let me prepare to get the next one. Next one I'll do is I'll, I'll pacify the wizard in the middle. Um, and then with you pull the dar, I guess. We have no problem pulling this. Hopefully we get the frenzy. All right, go for it. Nope, we got two. Wizard going on Mez. Wizard's been Mez. I'm ready. Okay, don't worry, we're good. Okay, wizard right here. Suppliers back up, guys. I don't know if he has a good bag, but uh, when we go around, we can swing around supplier, and maybe we'll, he has a nice baggie. All right, let's head over to the Magus placeholder, and oh, there's a guy here. Don't worry, we'll go right past him. Me too here. Stand by, I'm going to pass by the one behind you. 
Okay, got him. Bad pet. Oh, yeah. Okay. You guys are tearing them up. Good job, everybody. Okay, guys, hold on. I just hit 79. I'm going to have a seat real quick at the spells mend. Let's see what we've got this time. Hmm, must not have been many good spells. <laughs> I guess 79 is a bad level. Oh, got one spell. Strangling air, rank 2. Thanks, uh, David. Just got rank two, but nothing new. Uh, these are all like level 81. So I guess 79 was a bad level. I didn't bother buying anything. Okay, I see him. The one in front of you, Gore Dirt, is going to pacify. One behind you is clear to pull. Thanks, uh, Ramaldar. Some close calls so far tonight. We'll start off with a good wipe. What do you see that mega train? We get a little. I was a little complacent. I thought, oh, it's just low cock. You know, what do you worry? And it was like, bam, turned into a death trap. One. All it takes is one uh, vampire bat to run for it. Good DPS, guys. Okay, the tricky part now. Whoop, whoop. Oh, there's... Oh, my bad. One behind us. Got him. Messing him. Yeah, that's right. The spawn times David Henning are pretty good. This is a tough zone here. Oh, this guy's almost dead. job guys okay now with this one we're not supposed to run through the middle or let me check the map here no jump over this but then don't run straight forward either we'll go to the right okay and De uh, Ramaldar how does hardcore heritage work just jump over this pit right yeah, but there's two here that uh, we can kill. Uh oh, well, they didn't like me. Ay, 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 I'm going down. He's got the stun off. Let me go get the Mez on him. We're going straight ahead. Wow, my bad. Get the slow on him as quick as I can. These guys do hit hard. And uh, Ramaldar, how it, out in Twitch, the way it works is it's simply. Uh, during a two-week period, there's two phases, and all you do is just zone into old classic zones, and they have all upgraded mobs in them. 
And oh my god. I Bob fell down the pit. <laughs> uh oh. Can you come out? There should be a ladder down there for you. Yeah. We'll wait here for you. And the level we are, uh, OMG, uh, let's see, I'll go ahead and show you why I wait for Havilthorn to come back. There he is, he's up there, careful Havilthorn. Level 79, just ding 79, guys. Okay, so when you pop the map, you'll see that there's, we gotta stay to the side where Calamity is. We can't go straight because there's another pit there. Now we have a choice, we can go for the hand room or the mage's room. Uh, you know, the hand room's a little tricky, but we could always go into the hand room. What do you think? Or maybe mage is better, huh? Let's do them well, both. Let's do them both. Okay, who wants to do the honors for the pull? Which one? Oh, your pick, either one. Probably the hand is closer. Okay, let's move over to your side of the wall up here. Move up to about here, like this. As you can see, that's water he's going up to. He's got to go underwater. One second. And OMG, uh, I do have Diary Charm, but the problem is it's just, you know, it doesn't hold them only level 46 and below, I believe. Otherwise, a regular charm, like six minutes, which is the same as this other one. I heard it's reanimated hand and incoming Dargool. Okay, Dargool, I'm going to mess him. Messed him. Okay, he's messed. We'll wait for the hand. Speak to the hand. Give him the finger. Yeah, he's taking a long time. Come on. Okay, all on the hand. Taking his happy buffs off. There you go. Here you go, it's a moonstone ring. Next victim. Let's take a look at what it is. It's a, oh, it's just a regular band, not the, there's no new one, all right. Yeah, it has a OMG, it's a, I'm gonna leave it on, if anybody wants, go ahead and pick it up off the ground. It's an old fashioned one. Uh, Archmagus is up, guys. How did he show up on the target? Oh, it must have cleared his. Thing. Maybe we just got within track range. Okay, so go this way. Oh, watch out for that guy there. Okay, let's get ourselves some robes. There's one right here. Okay, I'm here. Yeah, good old Archmagus in there. Yep, yeah, and that's my pet, of course. Hold up for my pet. Got him back. Okay. Let me get the rune back up. Wow, what you know, just... just us. Okay, the room is a little tricky because it's a false wall here. Up oh, and oh, here we go. Sending my guy on him. I'm rooted. Okay, this guy here. I'm gonna mess. The Dar Knight. Think we should be good. Archmagus gonna get his Tosh. Man, he's gonna get slow. There you go, we got him. Ooh, 
Ooh, nice. And he got his friend here. Oh. Oh, wow. Look at this. A charm slot item. Very nice, guys. Yeah, OMG. I think I have the werewolf illusion. I can see. I'll check out and see if I've got it. Let me take a peek. Just might. Uh... Yeah, I'll definitely roll on that charm. Yeah, one second. Do I have werewolf illusion? I have illusion orc. I don't know if I bought it. Let me see. It should be here. Nope, you know what? I may not have bought it, but I got an orc illusion. Let's try the orc illusion real quick. Okay, so check out this charm. This is a really nice item for the charm slot. If you don't have TBM gear, you definitely want this. I'm going to try orc here. Oh, gosh, I'm too big. That's scary. Can't be that. Okay. I might be able to shrink you. Hang on. Oh, no, that's okay. He looked kind of ugly anyway. All right, let's set it to auto ass roll. And he dropped uh, silver silk leggings, the, the normal one. But the charm slot item is a unique item. And welcome aboard, Sean Boyd. SpaceX launch. All right, everybody's doing great. Hardcore heritage, lower guck. We've got the mages, so we're just going to run up to the uh, ghoul lord, see if he's there. And then back around to the supplier. There's also the patriarch and the elder, but I'm not sure if they're worth it. Here we go, guys, heading back through the fake wall, the fallsy wall. Going around this way, and there. Oh, there's a dude there. That's right, uh, OMG, it looks like World of Warcraft. So what's the? This is World of Warcraft, Granddaddy. Yeah, that's right. That orc look kind of World of Warcrafty. Uh, let me see what I have. This is a pacify. Let me see. You got a wizard stuck on the wall here. Really? Where is he? Just north. You can see his leg or whatever. Oh, okay. Yeah, Corgul. Oh, wow. Okay, let me go ahead and pacify him. Yeah, we can pull him through there, probably. That's an opening. Oh, yes it is. I'll send my pet to stomp him. Okay, taking his buffs off. At the high level, the game plays really, really fast. So you guys can see things happen quickly. Yeah, that's right, OMG. You know, new graphics engine would be awesome. It's just probably too much for them to do. And frog lock tongues for everybody. Wow, well, when these guys hit, they really don't mess around. There's two over on this side. Oh, okay. Up One on the this alcove, up on the front. step. Okay. Oh, oh, that didn't help. Oh, oh. Ruh row. <laughs> okay, I'm going to mess. Whoop. Got one there. Next guy going to mess. We got an ad. I'll mess ad real quick. Going with a mess. Whoops, that's my pet. Uh.
Okay, I see a dark goal facing the other way. I'll pacify. Oh, oh. Wow, we got more. Oh, shoot. Check out that kind of aggro radius. I'm dead. Okay, guys. Kill him for me. <laughs> oh, man. Yep, one interruption and uh, the mez doesn't go off or the stun, it's all over. The game gets fast. You can do it, guys. Nice kill. the healers casting promise no wonder yeah those frogs are vicious we got to keep the uh, healer on reactive I think I still see it casting promise I put him on reactive yeah feels like Turkish Angora nah you'll get a promise You guys can do it. Good fighting. Dangerous little frogs. Ding. Sweet. Oh, yes. Yeah. That's good. Get you up there. What level are you now? 77. Okay, great. Just in time, I got to get my buffs back up. Good job. Yeah, that's right. Get it up there. You make it up there, uh, Havelthorn, and uh, we'll be next week. We're going to be doing phase two. It's going to get really hairy there. I think um, I'm not sure which one we're going to start, but I'll show you guys on calendar. While I'm made up, it's going to be a little while. If anybody needs to go to the bathroom or anything, now is the time to do it. So we're done with phase one. There's still uh, old Sibyllis, but we're going to work this weekend on Cellos trying to hit 65. Come next week, phase two will start, and you'll see right here we got Crushbone, Permafrost, Miss Moore, and Nagfin's Lair. Those are closer to level, um, you know, I think Nagfin's closer to 105. No, Miss Moore's in 90, I mean, Miss Moore should be in the high 90s, same with Permafrost, probably Crushbone, but uh, we'll have to switch characters to, uh, to really have an effect on those. Yeah, Miss Moore inside the castle can get rough at level 100. Yeah, I can imagine. I took a look at some of the levels. It was like, okay, you got to bring a different uh, enchanter. This this Turkish Angor, he's not going to cut it because he'll get sliced in half in like two seconds. Uh, it will be really important to have good crowd control, be able to lock the stuff down because it's going to be crazy in there. You guys can see the kind of aggro we have here uh, just because of the dungeon on steroids and uh, you can imagine what's going to happen over on um, hardcore heritage it's, it's just amplified like in this case we you know the kind of hits we get in uh, classic you'd be able to take two or three of these guys maybe even four of them like you know with this kind of character a comparable character like in the 40s and stuff but hardcore heritage wow they just tear right through you so let's take a look at the calendar and talk about that we have um, 
death, death, death coming up after that. That's a kind of mission thing. And Hardcore Heritage will end on the 11th. And after that, when uh, Gates of Discord opens on Celos on Wednesday, July 3rd. But I believe it should be opening Eldon before that. Where is it? Hey, nobody cares about Eldon. Can you believe that, guys? There's no Eldon uh, being opened. Uh, yeah, there is in Solos. Oh, yeah, it is. I'm missing the day. Which day is it? I'm looking on the calendar. Just a second. Welcome, musical myth singers. Yeah, I'm trying to find it. I'm looking at May, then looked at June. And I don't see. Uh, oh, there it is. Oh, duh. Sell us in June 5th. Yep, June 5th. And so June 5th is coming in a couple weeks. And that's going to be Eldon. We're going to bring you some Eldon action. If you guys want to see Eldon raids from the Raid Progression series, you can look at last year. Uh, if their stuff has uh, mitigation and mighty, ain't no way we're going to be able to do it. But at least by the time Gates of Discord comes out, we won't even have to worry about Planes of Power flagging anymore. Because I've been looking at it, and uh, in order to get past the first lower tier dungeons, we've got to get flagged. And I guess that means you got to clear the raids. That's crazy. And that's right, Foolish Mortal, welcome aboard. A uh, player from played back with us back in Agnar. Yeah, I like that. You can we just pick up those dungeons and go for it anytime. I really like that. Let me get the rune back up. As you can see, this character was higher level before. He just got deleveled. Okay, so he's 79. Let me see what we have here. Time to change some spells. Quelling wave. What's that? Okay, the Quelling Wave goes up to 83, finally. So 1,000 mana, it's like to blow the whole load right there. We're going to put uh, there. I'm going to put Quelling Wave, and it lasts for 54 seconds. A.E. Mez, this will change the game dramatically. And let's see the Calm, 77. Uh, let's get the Enthrall, 79. No, that's not going to change. Charm, that's it for us. Let's get the rune up. 79 Brimstone, we'll go with this one, Rune of the Deep. Yes, it is, Musical Miss Singers. And <laughs> the nice thing about Celos is that it, each expansion is only a month. So <laughs> it's funny, we don't even worry about the spells because we'll be already in Gates of Discord by the time we get all our spells. And that's what's so funny about it. All right, guys, uh, I am back alive. Got my pants back on, and I'm ready for some action. So we have uh, the supplier is up, Minertar Patriarch and Elder, which are on the live side. Uh, we could go for, um, I'm just looking here. I think, let me sort by normal. And I think the, uh, that room spawned, so we can go back and hit up the supplier and then see where it goes from there. And if you guys want to continue to live, we can. Otherwise, we can think about what to do next or wind it up either way. All right. Okay, lead the way. There's some frogs that respawn. Oh, Calamity, you can cast group Invis Undead. Let's get together and cast group Invis Undead because my pet got is lost when I died. That's right, musical miss singers. I could just see that happen. So, is everyone close enough to get that? Uh, I got it. I got it. I'm good. Okay, watch out for the pit now. <laughs> watch out for the pit now, and I fell in it. Oh, gosh, that is so hilarious. Okay, how do I get out of this thing now? Oh gosh, there's a ladder. I'm funny. Ah, I got a little. Who do I think I am? I said I'm gonna take a little hop over there. Oh yeah, the one that tells everybody to watch out for the pitfalls in the pit. 
that's it happy jump all right james houseman welcome aboard yeah i know that's 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 funny uh happened in Belkador's labyrinth two years ago i was like okay guys this is how you do it you don't slip off the thing and i fell once i said i'm not going to do it again and i did good thing i had invis on dead otherwise i'd be dead again that's right i thought i could now this is much better just go in here and go go get our supplier bag that checks cavalry again real quick oh good job no placeholder yeah, he's a placeholder. All I see is Evil Eye up, uh, Tactician, Supplier, Patriarch, and Elder. I like this so much. All right, James Houseman out in Mangler. Yeah, we'll be back on Mangler too once, probably once Kunark opens or something. Right now it's a little too crowded over there. It's hard to to get any quality camps. So uh, we're gonna try to get up to speed on Cellos and then we're gonna come back to Mangler when it opens. It'll be fun when that happens. Uh, I remember last year in Cornab once uh, uh, Kunark opened, there's so much more to do. Okay, we got one guy in the back. We got one guy here. If you need a pass fight, go for it. Make sure there's one guy in Viso. I could cast in Viso, see in Viso on you. But I don't think that Assassin's there is just supplier. We can go up in the room and fight him there if you want. Hold on, I'm stuck in the ladder here. Oh, yeah, the ladder. Oh, you got to go for a rewind. Yeah, and Marcus, Marcus Amen. Sounds like Marcus Allen. Uh, Marcus Amon, we got the uh, mass tonight, the level 71 version, and I believe Hebblethorn got it. I'm not sure it's in the guild chat, but uh, he got it. If you check the stream earlier, you'll see we got the assassin and the supplier at the same time. I didn't even see the assassin on the, um, the, the list. If you want to pass by my target. Okay, Gordur's target. I'm pacifying. Stand by. Here we go. Got one. And again. Next one. Incoming. Oh, yeah. Okay. Supplier incoming. Oh, yes. Supplier. Give me. Oh, I don't have a pet, but that's okay. My pet was more trouble than these were. Ooh, nasty. And you know what? I forgot to load slow because it's not going to matter. Because I'm going to stun him instead this time. Thanks, Marcus Amen. I hope you like what we're doing. And this guy's going to be bad. Here's a new pet for you. Yeah, he looks like a fresh pet. Okay, going to stun him. Oh, don't kill me again. Oh, he sure hates me. Look at how these guys are so vicious. And keep in mind, this is a defiant geared character. So it's, it gives you about 15,000 hit points. Oh, ooh, there's a bag. Better be a good one. Oh, light burlap bag. Um, yeah, this is a sixty-five percent. This is a good bag. Of course. Um, yep, it sure is. But all you guys probably have those really killer bags. Thick banded belt again. Here's another one. Check it out. Look at that, guys. Okay, auto ask roll, guys. Roll for it. Nice bag. Of course, Evil Eye probably has a pretty good one, too. Welcome, Nick Martinez. That sounds familiar. Nick Martinez, did you play with us on Cornab? I think I remember the name. And James Houseman says, same as the Evil Eye bag, yeah. Is the Evil Eye named? Uh, he, he should have an Evil Eye bag. Maybe it's a, a new one. I'm not sure. His level wouldn't Black really and Evil Eye well. bag. I'm not sure. I would hope so. Usually not, though, but I don't know. Okay, who's the winner here? Uh, okay. Hablethorn, Thick Banded Bell. That's right, Nick Martinez. We played on Cornab. I remember the name. I remember all you guys. Welcome back. So, guys, here we're at the point here. Uh, does anybody want to go after the Elder and the Patriarch? uh that could we could wind it up out there if we get down that far sure 
Okay, so mm -hmm. let's do that. Let's um, uh, let's head. Do I'm, I don't think I'm liking you, Mr. Pet. Oh, just kill him. He's he's a bad pet. He's just smacking me all over the place. And that way, uh, I'll just be the normal enchanter. Yeah, the trains are just crazy, guys. Yeah, just check out some of the ones like um, Making of Blackened Alloy Medallion. And um, we started tonight off with the Mega Train. The whole dungeon came. But that just shows you how freaky and crazy hardcore heritage is. Okay, I'm gonna go petless. Um, just gonna go crowd control. Okay, once we get to the, uh, we can actually go uh, group invisa. I'll pop group invisa. Come around, everybody, and we can. We gotta be. Oh, I appear to be rooted still. Oh, you are. Okay, we'll wait for you. We don't want to leave you behind. For Four seconds. seconds. And then we'll head to the uh, gargoyle area, and sometimes some gargoyles see invisa. So then we'll go down and we'll, well, we have to be careful of down there. Let me pop group Lev up. Let me pop, uh, oh, this one forgot about the Almond Shadow. Perfect Inviso coming up. Okay, let's head forward. Let me check it out. Okay, Gargoyles, does anybody see Inviso? A lot of times they do. There's always one bad Gargoyle in the group. We got lucky today. None of them see Inviso. Let's go in. Come on in the room. And we're going to go down. Whoops. And you have Lev on, so make sure that when you hit the bottom. Whoa! Hang on a second, guys. we got to stop. Uh, Starveling 1. Wow. Acres on Mangler. Thank you so much for a huge donation tonight. Starveling 1. I think it's Starving 1. I'll mention you on the next live stream and we will honor your nice donation. Thank you so, so much. That's fantastic. Good to have you with us and uh, we'll see you back on Mangler when we get back there. Thank you so much, you guys. All the wonderful donations all you guys have been given. I really, really appreciate it. It really, uh, really motivates me to put out new content and uh, new player videos, all that kind of stuff. You guys just give me suggestions on what would be good. But everybody says they like what's happening. Now, make sure you hit page up when you go over this because there's a trap in the floor. And I want to tell you something. No matter how many times we try to jump it, somebody always falls in. And it's usually me. So we're going to go over this, levitate over that, and whoop, whoop, like that. Acres on Mangler. All right. And, uh, yeah, I'm glad you like it. I'm glad you do. We, we enjoy it too and this some of these dudes may see through inviso i'm gonna go down this way go get some bags guys i'm gonna go this way oh wait wait this is the wrong way where is the elder guy at hey he's supposed to be back there sorry i passed him okay he's back here guys somewhere He better drop something good. We're not going to kill all these. Oh. He's in the pit down here. Hmm. I can't charm him. Oh, he can see me. He's dubious to me. Oh, he must like elves. Okay, so it looks like we're going to have to kill him. Come on down, guys. Come on into the pit. Yeah, this is him, guys. Uh, and he's got all these buffs, so the first things we're going to do is we're going to take all his happy buffs off. Happy buffs and his, his well, how about the one standing at the top of the ladder? Is he going to come down? Oh, okay, hang on a second. Let me pacify him. He might be a pet, he, then. He's amiable to me. Oh, he likes me. Because you're part of the <laughs> then. Okay, this is, <laughs> go for the elder, guys. I'm going to take his buffs off right now. Uh, I'm not going to use a pet, but who needs one? And his bro was just saying, oh, yeah. He's like, yep, yeah, you're dead. Mono a mono, hand to hand, guys. The way it should be. His friend's saying, good fight, yeah. 
Good fight. Keep up the good fight. Smack him around. He said, keep up the good fight. Oh, I like that. Kill them and they won't assist. Drop your goodies on us. Oh, where do you think you're going? No. Oh, shoot. Who said you can run? What the heck? Seriously, where did he go? Oh, another nightmare. They hit really hard, guys. They just hit like a Mack truck. Oh, gosh. I'm going to hit Mez. I'm trying to. Oh, now we got Froglock Heaven here. Something told me this is a scary spot. Oh, what do we got here? Come on. Mezzing this guy. Oh, gosh. He leaves our little froggy friend alone. Popping a Mez. I know. Rut row. That's right. It's in the rut row time because this is. <laughs> oh, shoot. You know, this is a, the kind of aggro you've got. Well, the, the elder finally died. Good. Okay, this, anyway, this guy here. Preparing to AE Mez them. I'm going to go with AE Mez. Okay, we're just going to teach him a lesson. We're going to kill them all. Where'd they all go? They're right here. We got frogs galore. It's building up. And our, our, our pet. I mean, our Merc just died, guys. Oh, sheesh. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is getting scary. Ah, died again. Um, Maybe somebody wants a feign death if it gets too bad. I think you guys can fight it off. I just did it. I just did it 12%. Wow. Come on, Gordurt. You can do it. Getting ready to burn disciplines. You can do it, man. <laughs> what happened? He, he warped into the wall, the elder. Oh my. Typical cl uh, lower guck. Yes, and David Hedinger definitely going to give Pantheon a try. I mean, with a game like that, as big as it is, got to give it a try. Definitely, definitely got to. I'm just waiting for when is it going to be ready. That's all. When it's ready, I'm ready to go for it. I've been hearing about Pantheon for about a year now. I've been hearing it's a couple years, but I know it's going to take a while, but it looks fantastic. Saving my money to upgrade the computer and everything for the right time. Don't want to upgrade it now because if Pantheon comes out in two, three years, I'll have an old PC like I do now. Go Havelthorn, slice and dice. Okay, so the talisman looks like this. I can't click it on it now. And all you guys out there, if you're watching this, you can see just how fast enchanters get killed in the high level game compared to low level game. This kind of train was, in a low level game, I'd be able to regain control and, and work it. But in the high level game, it's, it's pretty much you miss one or get interrupted once or twice and it's over. Look at how the hits are coming in here. Look at that. Wow. Good job. And uh, in the low level game, I can go into Runny Eye and, or Permafrost and just in the glory days and just hang in there and fight the fight to the end, hand to hand. But up here, man, it's like a action game. Crazy frogs. You guys can do it. <laughs> That's right, Alia Troy. Yep, you got it. You know when to come in. Minotaur axe. And as soon as they get res, you guys, you guys are doing it. There weren't that many. You know, that's right. Werewolf uh, illusion would be good. Good job keeping the merc up, guys. Or, I mean, it died, I guess. But fight it to last drop of blood. Yeah, I think we got this. Yeah. yeah. All out. It's a tough little win night. Look at that pile there. <laughs> Should have tried to charm one, actually. Oh, 
Oh gosh, is he running? Yeah, but not far. You guys did it, that pile there. Minute 13 to bring my Merc back. Reggie. That's, that's cool. And that's why you bring tanks with you. In the higher level game, you need real tanks. Um, you can see the difference between real tanks and uh, not so real tanks. No more enchanter tanking. But looking back on it, I should have uh, tried to charm one to break it up. That would have been probably a better choice. But uh, didn't think fast enough. That's a nice pile of corpses. So when we get back to cells, we're going to be bringing you guys. Um, we're going to try to get into the flagging so that we can get past Plane of Justice. So we can get into uh, Plane of Storms, Plane of Nightmare, I think we can get into. We're at 57. We're going to try to keep pushing to 65. Looks like I'm going to be sent back to POK. Um, and Saphir, welcome aboard. I don't know if they left that corpse in there. I'm going to respawn in POK. Merc's back up. Oh, too late. Hey, he'll bring you back. And, uh, OMG, the, um, classes are, we have, a, uh, one Merc, and we have, uh, Monk, we have, uh, two Rogues, and a Shadow Knight, and I'm the Enchanter, so it's all heavy DPS classes. They're pretty well geared. Most people are TBM geared, except me. You can see the difference, but of course enchanters die really fast. But that was still good. I, I don't mind. As long as the team wins, because we have more people standing at the end, it's a victory. Everybody set up for the roll in that um, dark and Clisalberry tiles. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that. That's pretty good. I'll set it up. I think oh. it changed it to me because you died. Yeah, you go for it. Thank you for the res. It's, it's droppable even. Ooh, that's nice. If only we could copy that to Mangler. It'd be like 100 chrono. And Nick Martinez, we are playing on the test server. And next week, we will be back with Hardcore Heritage Phase 2. And I think, I don't know, I'm going to ask Iceman. Iceman, what dungeon in Phase 2 should we start with? What's the easiest one? Uh, probably Crushbone. Okay, and what would go after Crushbone? Emperor Crush. Oh, I mean... Oh, after? Uh, probably Miss Moore. Ooh, and then we have Perm yeah, that's right, Permafrost and Nagy are like level 100. Auto ask roll, guys, go ahead and roll for it. Yeah, we'll need some serious on a bandit tonight. What's that? Hablethorn's winning like crazy tonight. He's got a little bit of dice from ZZ. He needs it. Hablethorn, we gotta level you up because we're gonna need you as we get up there because as we go on, we're going to continue the raid progression series. And if you guys out there have been watching that, that took a backseat. Um, when we were, after we did Soul Terrace, we didn't finish Soul Terrace, but it took a backseat. And uh, we'll continue because we want to do House of Thule. We want to do some Seeds of Destruction and all that. So uh, we want to keep that up, but we're going to need to develop our player base here, our, our people to get them up there so we can... And a lot of us have 110 level characters, and we're going to need those at, at appropriate times. But yeah, Hablethorn, we're going to get your character up there, so take all the goodies. Keep on winning. Yeah, it's time to me, for me to put some buffs up. I'll be right back in action in a moment. That's it. Right. Sweet. Yeah, we love to have you there. We will, as you know, we need real characters. All these, a lot of these raids are, are set up that way. Where, I mean, some of them, you know, they're DPS races, but a lot of them are, well, I don't want to mention the Sisters event anymore, the worst raid ever, but um, some of them are, you know, you got to be here, you got to click this, click that at the right time. There are a lot of coordination type things. Yeah, next time I'm going to pop Dire Charm on that guy. 
And thank you guys for being patient here. Uh, Nick Martinez, no desk notes is busy at work. He has a new work schedule and um, the work schedule is really tough. So, and he's on the East Coast and I'm on the West Coast. So by the time we start playing, it's already almost midnight time to go to bed. So he can't join us. But, you know, like I've been telling everybody in the beginning, if there's one person that can catch up, it's him. I never worry about it. On Celos, he will be able to do it. Because when he came in on Cornav, everybody was already level 50. And he just started about a month later and he was like level 20. And I was like, well... Good luck. And then the next thing I know, when Kunark opened about a month later, he was the highest level one in the guild. So um, don't worry about him. You know, uh, anybody that could level up that quick on Kornav has got what it takes. Because that experience over there was very slow compared to Mangler even. And compared to Celos, he, he might be able to do that and catch up in a week. Because uh, we're going to be locked at 65 for a long time. So don't worry. We'll probably be, when we lock out on... Celos will probably go back to Mangler because they'll probably open Kunark and we'll get back into the swing of things like that. Lots of stuff going on. Okay, guys, I am back. Let me pop uh, these two. Oh, they both work nice. Okay, I'm going to pop perfect. Whoops, we got one perfect lev. Don't really need that. And Wara didn't log into Tess. All right. Hey, guys, I'm ready. My man is back. Okay, going up the happy ladder. I hate ladders. Ladders are another game in itself. They really are. Okay, final victim is Minotaur Patriarch. Of course, we cannot see if the king is even on track. We could try to go down to the king. The tactician is up also. He probably has... We could always go like this. We could try to see if the patriarch is up because he's kind of on the way. And then we can go by and see if the king is up and make that the final uh, destination. Not like the scary movie, but it could turn out that way. Okay, guys, let's go this way. I think I see where the patriarch is. Everybody with me? And then we'll, hit, we'll knock over the evil eye, too. Okay, so we can go like this. we got to go straight. And hopefully they don't see Inviso. Because I want to get over there and just knock over the Patriarch. And this is a Wanster here. And Minotaur, let's see. There's always one that tricks me. Not him. I'm on Patriarch. Where are you? Take a right. And take a left down here. I fall Gore Dirt. I hope he's in his Holio. Frog like Shin Warrior. Where are ye? Huh? Oh, no. Where is he? He's on track. He's a roamer. Oh, gosh. So that means he's not here. He's running around somewhere. We gotta go knock him off. Want to go ahead over to the Evil Eye first and go search him? Let me look through the wall. I'm gonna just follow Gordur because Evil Eye is kind of far away. Oh, it's not. It's right around the corner. Really? I see. Yeah. Oh, kind of, yeah. Okay, I'll follow Gordur. We'll stay together just in case. And he's a gnome. He can do uh, see through the wall method. Hey, trick right here. Oh, gosh. There he is. Okay, guys. Oh, wow. Okay. Fix his wagon. Taking his buffs off. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. Wan Knight. Okay, let me go ahead and charm Wan Knight. Jeez, got enough buffs on him. So they really seriously buffed him. Come here. Come here, little picker. Oh, I cannot. Come on. Got him. Okay, good. That was just lag. Now we got, oh, his whole family. Wow, talk about the family came out. Jeez, you know it's going to be a train every single time. The trains are here. They're not messing around. Got keeping me busy. They're dead. And now we got this guy, his bro. Wow. That is crazy. You know it's gonna be a train every time. Get my pet in gear. Go, go, go. 
check out the loot later. Is try to stay alive now. All right, next victim. Let's take off his. Oh, good. I like that. Somebody smacked him. Oh, this is my pet here. Rogue. Got some rogue power. Yeah, I know that that was almost a wipe wipe there. Oh yeah, backstab time. I'll take your mana first. Popping him with a stun. Where's the rest of these guys come from? There is this guy here. Got him on Mez. Look at how many buffs he you know he's you're gonna need two recant magics it take all his, his junk off. And this guy too. Wow, all I'm doing is casting recant magic. And Saphir, your 85 mage will work. You gotta have Discord though. That's the one thing is uh, if, if you join us, you must have Discord. Because there'll be no way we can see everybody through text. It's all by voice. Dispelling again. We got the Sue Shaman here. Okay, got this guy. Okay. Nice recovery. Wow. I thought that was going to be my next death. That was fun. Finally got him this time. This time I did the right thing. It charmed one to reduce him by one and then use him to... To fight for us. We're going to take this guy. He is um, level 76. It's assassinating left and right. You were doing that? Both you guys? Yeah. We need more of those. That's why we got through the last one. You guys are like tearing it up. Okay, let's see what the loot is. I almost forgot about that. We have uh, Darkened Azure Sleeves. Okay, so it's there. We have Ebony Bladed Sword. Woo, look at this. Oh, we don't want that. That's a not the darkened one. Ranger only. Yeah, Minotaur Battle Axe. And nothing else. Okay, so the darkened Azure sleeves are pretty nice. Cleave 3. Look at that. That's a, a good um, effect to have on it. Okay, guys, setting it to auto-ass roll. Um, anybody can use it. Some sweet items. Yeah, I'll pass on that one. Okay, you're going to pass. All right, you, you can sit and put it in the bazaar or whatever. Well, there's no bazaar here, <laughs> so. All right. Good job, guys. Okay, so next stop is going to be Evil Eye, and then we're going to go deep all the way to King Room. All the way to King Room. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, I can't go in Viz now because I got a pet. Unless we're going to dispose of him. Gonna run by him real fast. Oh, here we go. Go this way here. Got one up here. Okay, send in my little missile. Go get him. Oh, whoa. All right, don't worry. I'm just gonna pop AE Mez on them. Uh, supposed to work, but it didn't. That's okay. You guys just keep assassinating him like that. Wow. And you. Give me some mana. Uh, an OMG, are Rangers viable DPS? Is yes, they are. They definitely are. Oh, yes. At the high level, definitely great DPS. Not good tanks, but good DPS. Once you get in this quiver, yeah. Oh, yeah. And Zizi plays a high-level ranger. And some raids are specifically designed for that. Like in House of Thule, the tree stump guy, you know, you, he's got a damage shield on him, and you got to bait. It's basically a, a ranged fight. So rangers are perfect. They never run out of mana when it comes to that. Okay, go into the evil eye pit. I mean, spot.
Okay, Mr. Evil Eye is... Level 75. Okay, the real deal, and we have... Oh, look, we got somebody in the water, too. Let's bring this guy in. Okay. Oh, and how did the eyeball come after us? Okay, eyeball. I'm going to mess eyeball. He need, looks like he needs some Visine. Oh, he came out of it. Sorry. Yeah, it's okay. I just stunned him once. Might as well kill him now. Oh, yeah, eyeball. Your days are over. Cool looking thing. Oh, yeah. Let's see what bag you got. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. Bag. Darkened evil eye bag. Check it out. Oh, weight reduction 90. <laughs> That's so funny. You know what I think would have been cool is if they put a 40 slot bag in here. You know, they could have made a 40 slotter. Totally. Yeah, this is like, it went, the previous one is this. If you look at the previous one, it's 70. So you went from 70, you went from 90. And it's like, oh, really? So. And, and too much. And I can't even roll on, on the original one because I, I have one from way, way back in the day. Oh, that's hilarious. I'm going to roll on the original one. I don't need the, the darkened one. Um, go ahead, guys. Get get a roll on it. And yeah, at this stage, what's funny is... Um, oh, let's go ahead and kill this guy here. He's worthless. We'll uh, go ahead and take him down, guys. And uh, what we'll do is I'll, we'll go in Viz. We'll get further down there, get a real pet. Dang, you guys are smacking him. Okay, so this, if you give it, give you an idea, at this rate, you can get the Treasure Hunter Satchel, which is 100% weight reduction, and you can just get a couple friends together, like a group like this, and you can go take down Fady Dar, you know, just keep romping on Fady Dar, who spawns every day, and you can take him down. You can get the Treasure Hunter Satchel, so compare it to the other one. It weighs only 0.4 and all that. So they should have really made this a bigger, bigger bag. 40 slot, I'd say. Adjusting my earpiece and getting ready. Okay, let's see who won. Uh... I got it. Sweet. Con congrats, man. Good I man. Got the regular one. Whatever you do, don't throw away your 40 slot. Hang on, I'm going to hit group perfect in Vizzo in one moment. I got to put my safety rune, like my safety pants here. Because <laughs> I get ripped in half so easy. Oh, good news for you. Uh, when you hit 80, you get two more spell slots. That'll help me. Two more stuns. Twice the amount of life saving. Okay, so let's see. We're going to go straight this way here. Oh, we got a wizard. Where was he? Oh, he's in the water. Let's just keep going, make him come out of the water. All right, Josh Larson. Thanks for joining us and glad you like him. Which video do you like? Oh, we got some bad boys here. Which video do you like? Uh, let me know. I, I'm working on making more stuff. I, ha I already have a lot of stuff. Some stuff I just can't release yet. Uh, it's a little early. Somebody got, I heard a swing. I got no slow on him. Oh yeah, assassinate him with those daggers. Yeah, he's undead. I can't do it. Oh, I see. Take his mana, that's good. And he's got a pet. And down he goes. And uh, have the mon when you shout. Oh, that's a good sign then. It's really good. Okay, this guy's an undead. Let me see what we have here. Uh, 75. All right. And uh, yeah, if, if they're on the shower, that's a really good sign. 
got to listen to them all the time because you never know what you're going to miss. Okay, I think we can use Group Perfect Invisible, which I got. Okay, next thing is we can get close to, I, my ranger is not far enough to track the Cavalier, I mean, not, I mean the Crusader Fortress, but we can send Gordurt in there because he is a, a rogue, and oh, either of you two guys can go in there, and I go right over here, just stand here. Okay, check it out, guys. Let us know if the Crusader is up. If he's not, we'll continue on to the Noble, Herbalist, and tactician i think i should be able to see him i don't think he's up but you never know Probably nothing, huh? No, not up. Okay, guys. So let's, uh, uh, James Hollister, welcome back. Uh, let's go this way here. Follow me. We're going to head over to Noble. I don't think Noble's up. We're just going to go for the tactician. And uh, after tactician, we're going to hit up. Uh, let's go in this way here. We're going to, we can exit out from there. Or we can kill off the king room, and that'll be a good place for a final shot. I'm going to go down here. Yeah, if my ranger can see all the way up there, then it probably means that uh, it is not there. You can see all the way to the tactician. Okay, we're going down here and going in here. I didn't see the noble. And we're coming up to the herbalist. I don't think there's an herbalist. And he's 77. Hmm. Might be decent. Okay, we're going to continue on. We're almost at a king room. Oh, and there's no king. But this guy can be my pet. Oh, he's going away. Okay, now the, you can see where the tactician is. He's upstairs here, but I don't know how we're going to get him. Uh, I can try to pass by. Usually the whole room comes, so it's going to be one of these uh, gigantic fights. Wow, look at the Guck Knight there. He is uh, level 81. Oh, my. We can only pacify certain ones. There's What is that, a basil basilic? What's he doing in here? By the way, our time with assurance is getting low. Okay, we'll hurry it up. Okay, so what we're going to do is uh, I'm going to start pacifying. Uh, I'll pacify Basilic first, and then Gordur can target stuff, and we'll go with that. Landed. Okay, Gordur, next target. Okay. Rock Knight, pacifying coming. Oh, yep. Whoops, he resisted. Ooh, that could be scary. Trying again. Landed. Okay, next target. Okay. Gunk Knight, he's too high to pacify. Okay, Shaman. Okay, got to work fast, Shaman, pacify. Okay, other stuff may be going down. You may want to try to pull Gunk Knight in the middle. Pull Okay, so we got Tactician. I'm going to try to Mez Tactician. Oh, what is that? Bach Knight? Okay, Bach Knight. I cannot, I'm going to just Mez because I can't charm them. Of the level, Bach Knight has been missed. Tactician cannot miss him. Uh, maybe I can. I'm trying to miss Tactician. Tactician has been missed. Dar Knight is going to be the pet. Going with the charm, firing. Come on, Dar Knight. Oh, he cannot charm. Okay, going to miss him. Just going to slowly miss these guys out. Bach Knight, uh, he's been there. Do you want Tactician dead now? Uh, yeah, go for Tactician. I can't charm any of them, so. Um, okay. Okay, let's go ahead and dispel Tactician. Okay, there you go. Pop the stone. Nice. 
Nice work. Yep, this guy's too high level. Uh, the Darn it. Okay, go for it. Yeah, and Nick Martinez, I had to turn off the spell particle effects because it was too too much lag. I get in some periods where I got lag, totally lagged out. Yeah, because the lag was really, really bad. Oh yeah, we'll take him down. Nice job. Have to do that. Whoa, our pet's gonna bite it. Oh, it's okay. We don't need him anyway. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we got them both. Nice work. One and two. Oh, did he run? Yeah, oh, bring, bring oh no. Gar Granite Gargoyle. Okay, I'm going to get him. I hope that's just the only one. Let me met charm him. Try to. Come on. Got him. The guys. Uh, okay, guys, follow me. Let's go right into the room. Follow me. We have no way out of here. We got to zone it out. The way you go is go behind. Ow. Ow. No, 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 no. Uh, go out here, guys. Right back here. Come, ow. Just zone out, guys. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, gosh. I, I don't think he even ran away. I think he went through the wall. Yeah. Okay, so now there's a bunch of loot like dark, dark and Platinum Tiara, and there's a Black Tome with Silver Runes in there, but... Huh. Why can't I zone out? You should be able to. Go back and forth. Maybe you went too fast. Can you yeah, fade Yeah, that was it. Yeah, I got out. Okay, you got out. Good. Okay, well, we left a little bit of loot back in there. That's the only problem. There's uh, the, the stuff, but... You know, we just we can just leave it there. There's a platinum tiara. I can't see what they are, but that bass looks so bad. And black tome with silver runes. You don't need a black tome with silver runes. That's a regular one. The only one that's good is a dark and platinum tiara. We'll just leave it there, I guess. I'm still here. I'll loot it. Oh, you are. Oh, sweet. Okay, so let me set it to um, leave on corpse. Or I'll just set it to enable free grab. Okay, set it to enable free grab. Sweet. Got it. Way to go. Okay, I'm going to respawn back in POK. Don't bother rezzing this guy. That's right, Saphir. And when the trains come, they really come. It's a uh, hardcore heritage. Wow. But the nice thing about it is it plays even harder, I think, than the regular zone. The regular zone at level 50 is kind of slow. Things take a while to develop. But over here, it's a split second. Like one train I derailed by charming one guy. This time, it didn't happen that way. You got to be have lightning fast reflexes to make it happen. We going back to POK? Yeah, I just head back to POK. We're at the buff spot. We'll just do the sign off right here. If you guys, can you make it to the buff spot? Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm at the bus spot then. And as usual, that was just crazy, crazy good. So the tactician, I guess he had the tiara, which is kind of interesting. And you survived. I'm heading in there. All right, we'll take a look at the, uh, the last item. Good job, everybody. Yeah, that's right, Foolish Mortal. You see how fast it develops. Of course, if I get TBM geared... I'll have a, you know, a few more seconds, but usually one hit and it got me halfway. The next hit, I'm dead. But that's what makes it exciting. The game plays really fast. Not for the faint of heart. That's super exciting. Let's see what we have here. Level 80 is when the new stuff comes in. So... Yeah, we'll we'll see you guys. Uh, we'll wait till everybody gets back here, and then we'll do the final shot. I went to Black Bear from Ocean Green once and almost. <laughs> yeah, the that one is a that's a good one too. Habblethorn made it back. Congratulations. 
Let's see, how's everybody doing? I'm right around the corner. Poor Dirt 78, Havilthorn 77, Calamity 80. Congratulations, Calamity. Uh, Pius at 78. Yeah, no, yeah, I have that other a... mini quest to do. The one where you go to update your AUG. Yeah, oh yeah, that one. That That's the longest quest, buying the AUGs. All right, guys. Thanks for joining all of you out there, and thanks for the nice donation out there and for keeping us going. And uh, we're going to be back tomorrow night with Celos, and we're going to run through the whole weekend on Celos and get some uh, levels. We're going to probably start doing raiding once we get above 60. We could probably do some of the stuff one group without that doesn't have mitigation and mighty, so stay tuned for that. And there will be more uh, videos coming. So guys, have a great Memorial Day holiday. It's going to be fun for all of you, and we will see you at the next live stream. Thanks for joining.